Lady. How's it going, everybody? Zero, one of one, back again, and uh, playing Space Engineers. And uh, yeah, um, we're still working on our little spaceport. And when I say little, I don't actually mean little. Um, but uh, you know, our spaceport, I'm working on it. Uh, let's see. I feel like, how did I do it over here? Is that just all the way to the bottom? It is, okay. Right. Okay, so I'm gonna take out this level here. Um, there we go. And then I suppose I could take out that too. Just make it even, at least. Something like that, I don't know. It's fine. Uh, okay, so let's go back over here. All right, so in the last episode, uh, we were working on these uh, lower rooms here, which I did not complete, at least not all the way. And then we'll go over here, hop down here, okay, good. So here's this little room. This one is basically done. Um, little bed over here, we got a uh, you know, little fish tank, little, uh, little living room area, little workspace, you know, little place over here where you can kind of chill, relax, whatever. Um, yeah. And then uh, this one is not, well, neither of these are built, actually. Uh, I just have the beds in there, and that's about it. Um, and then we got this one, which is going to be uh, fancier. And uh, I just got to figure out what all I want to put in here and where I want to put it all in here. I don't know. Um, let's just do LCD. Get this little guy over here, in here. Get it so it looks fancy. And then uh, we'll get a couch. Another couple couches. I don't know. It'll be fine. Um, and then he has a bathroom over here, which is good. Um, yeah, so that'll be fine here. Uh, workspace, that could be useful. Um, desk space. There, now you have like the best view. Um, all right. And we'll throw some of these things on here. Just to kind of, I don't know. Spice it up a little bit. Make it roundish. All right, so that should be good here. Um, could I do like a passage in here? A little corner passage. What's that gonna look like? Well, that'll be kind of like our bathroom entrance right here. So you can kind of go through this. Uh, that has to stay as it is, which means I can put something in here. Um, let me... Here we go. Make it fancy. All right, so that should be okay there. And you know, just a nice little, nice little space in here. Okay, so I'm gonna call this room done for now. I guess it doesn't really need to be like all the way amazingly done. And then uh, these ones will just be kind of like more basic rooms, I guess. Uh, Let's just put this into here. Um, let's see, uh, let's throw in a shower. Do we want the shower right by the entrance? Probably not, right? I mean, there isn't really too many other places where we can put it, right? I mean, we could do it like this, this'll work. This'll be fine. Uh, bathroom. 
that needs to go into here. There we go. Now we can just like walk in here, do our business. Um, and then over here, um, let's throw a couch in here. Just a little couch. And then we'll do an LCD to cover up this. That'll work there. And then, um, I don't know, do like a desk or something. Nice little corner desk over here. Could have it go this way, maybe. I don't know. And then over here, maybe put it in another couch. Yeah, easy enough. Nothing too special. Um, let's do a passage with a light, just because it's interesting. Um, okay, so then that means that I can cover all of this up. And then, okay, that's already there, good to go. Um, This doesn't really matter too much, but we'll we'll make it a little little fancy, just a little fancy, not super fancy, just just a little fancy. Okay, and then that needs to be a forty-five over here, forty-five over here. And then we'll change that color. We'll change that color. We'll change this color. Um, yeah, yeah, that should be good enough. Um, doesn't need to be like amazing or anything, just, you know, little, little room, little place to put stuff. Um, and then I can do, let's see, bathroom, just basically do the same thing over here, just, you know, different orientation, I guess, and shower. Um, that can go there, and uh, let's see, another little passage with a light over here, and then, um, let's see, LCD over here, put that on that wall, then we'll have a desk over here, kind of, um, yeah, and then we want to do this with the wood. We go so that'll go kind of there and then we'll get a little couch over here and then uh oh i can't actually fit the couch here interesting hmm Okay, so the only other way to get this to work is to reverse those, which, you know, fine. Uh, bathroom has to go over here this time. And then the shower, just uh, make sure if you're using the shower, you don't have your door open. And then we can put a little couch over here and that should work. There we go. And then, uh, let's see, you need to do, nope, this, this, there we go. Block, 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 block. Okay. And then we go into this, that. That can go there, that can go there. That can go there, that can go there. Uh, that one can go there. Good to go. All right, easy enough. So those rooms are now done. 
Um, hallway, mostly done. I should put like a carpet or something in here. What do you think? Um, so let's go with uh, light armor panels and see. Or I could. This actually makes for nice flooring. And then we can rotate that to go that way. It doesn't exactly match up, but you know what? It's fine. Wonderful. All right. Yeah, that should be good. And then we go up here, and it's a whole other thing that we got to figure out. Um, let's see. So if I do this, um, we're going to want something in here to sort of use up this space. So we'll throw in a couch. Um, That'll go out that way. And the reason why I wanted to do that is because then I can take this block. Uh, nope. Uh, this block. And apparently I'm out of steel sheets. OK, so that can go in there like that. We'll just leave that in there like that, and it should be fine, right? Uh, might as well put that in there too, because why not? All right, so then uh, we're going to have to do something over here for... I could make these more like, uh, I don't know, like hangout areas, right? And then I can do like a half block or something in here. So you still get access to like all the AV stuff, I guess. And then, um, yeah, and then we can do like a little couchy couch over here. Um, make it fancy because reasons. Actually, you know what I could do? Uh, let's do a dispenser. This will be a good place to put that. And then uh, we're going to need a little couch couch over here. And then uh, let's see, we'll do straight couch down the middle here. That'll be good. All right, so that can do that. And then I can do like kind of like a I could just make this whole thing a room. It's easy enough, right? And then uh, as far as this goes, um, let's go with something like this, I guess. I don't know. That'll be fine, right? Um, do I want this to be anything? Interesting or no? Um, nah, we'll just make these just standard just kind of hangout rooms for people go in there hang out, you know uh, Okay, so then I got to go into here Throw that onto there Something like that, anyways. So then this is just kind of like a little AV room, right? Uh, is there anything that I want to put here? Is there anything that I need to put in here? Hmm. 
Let's do something a little different here. So let's put in a couple little consoles here so you can program whatever it is you want to play or watch or, you know, whatever. And that can just go in there like that. It'll be fine. Okay, and then I got enough room for another AV room over here. So we'll just build this one the same way, just opposite. Um, that's all the way against the end. Yes, it is. Good to go. All right. So, um, couch. I could just go with this one, right? Uh, change the color to wood. Deep mahogany wood. We're high class here. You know what I mean? All right. And then, uh, inset blocks. We're going to need one of these things. Uh, just regular old boring gray. Uh, yeah, that'll go there. And then we'll need inset panels. That'll go there. Um, and then uh, this doesn't actually need it to be anything. I mean, it is because we want snacks, of course. But and then I think this has to be fancy. Fancy block, fancy snacks, yeah. All right, so then that will go there, and then we need to put the door. Uh, do, 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 do. There, so we can get in there. Um, let's see, I'm gonna go borrow Carl's. Uh, Little healer, healer thingy. Here we go. Okay, good to go. All right, and then that can go to here. And then back here, I can just do like a, you know, sort of like a, what's the word? Um, storage area, maintenance area, I don't know. Just something that doesn't really need any particular thing, I guess. Um, what does this go to and is that important? It is not, okay. Good to go. Um, all right, now we have this up there. We have all of that here. So what I may end up doing is making this a very fancy hallway. Oh, right, that's a full block right there. Um, hmm. No, go to the pink, okay. All right, uh, we'll go back into this and uh, we're gonna go into the seven block here. Grab these little doodads here. Oh, um, except that one. That one gets to change. Uh, so that one has to be the one on the corner, yeah. Nope, that one. There we go. And then I could put this in there like that and have this just be like a little tiny hallway here or I could make it wider. I like that better, wider. And then uh, we can put this down going this way. I don't know, until we can figure out what we want to do with the rest of this. And then for this area up here, uh, we could make it fancy. All 
All right, and then that will allow me to open up another area over here, which I could just make more of these little rooms with. Um, hmm. Okay, so then if this is gonna be storage here, uh, we're gonna want, yeah, that's gotta be blocked in. Do, 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 do. And I can just kind of go there, I guess. Um, I wonder what this would look like. If it would block access or not. Doesn't look like it will. Um, oh, right, I can't actually do that because I can't put a block there. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, that's fine. Um, okay, so if that's the case, then... Uh, hmm. Okay, so we're gonna need something solid on the back of here that acts as some sort of a uh, storage, like uh, some lockers. And then, uh, let's see, I think that's in, I think that's in a wasteland, yeah. And then this gets to be boring and gray it doesn't have to be boring and gray, but I wonder what happens if I made it like red and no, that changes colors of everything. Don't like it. Nope. Um, uh, let's make it battered and gray because we're boring like that. Um, and then that can go to there, I suppose. Do I have like a corner? I do have this one. Wait, wait, no, don't I have like an actual armory? Like a corner armory? Thought I did. Armory. Oh, I don't. Um, what am I thinking of? Is it warfare? No. Yes. Weapon rack. There we go. It's not a corner piece exactly, but you know. We'll just, uh, I don't know, put that in here and in there. Should be fine. And then uh, we'll go back into Wasteland and we'll throw in some more of these things. Um, that'll just go there. And then storage shelf three for the big heavy parts. That should be fine. And then um, I could actually make these a double level. Viking, welcome. Okay, and then this can just kind of built up storage shelf over here and we'll do another level one over here I guess that'll be fine okay so now we have all kinds of storage in here just first stuff um, kind of like uh, the closet I guess um, okay so now what we need to do is get some windows throw them on here uh, okay, that can go to there, and then that can place off of that. That can go there, that can go there. Here we go. It's fancy. It looks weird because there's like blocks and everything in there, but it just makes it look a bit more uh, interesting. Also, how do I get in here? Okay, this is like the last open spot right here. Uh, okay, so I'm trying to think of what the corner piece for this would look like. Hmm. I don't know. It's fine. 
Um, that can go to there. Good. And then, um, I don't know, just go back to normal blocks or whatever. Set door here because reasons. Neat. All right, and then panel. Make this the wooden panel. Here we go. Rotate it so it goes that way. There we go. Nice little hallway here. Uh, do I have a half block light? Probably not. Nope, most definitely do not. Hmm. Well, it's going to be very, very dark in here without that light. Um, hmm. What does this go to? What is it for? Oh, nope. That's got to stay right there. Also, why is my tool gone? So that has to stay. So I can't do anything with that. Um, and then this is solid block here. I wonder. Get rid of that block. Get rid of that block. Okay. And then we can do block, block, no, this block, that color, inset, light, good. Throw that there, throw that there. I don't know what that's going to look like below here, if that's going to throw things off. Yep. Most certainly is. Hmm. Okay, well. Oh, I didn't mean to get rid of that light. Dang it. Now, to cover that up, let's see. Uh, we're going to go into this, but first we have to go to the wood color thing. Uh, let's see. That can go into here like this. Except that can probably change. Um, yeah. Okay, it looks a little a little fancier. Um, and then this is going to have to be uh, 
this block, I believe. Or, or, or. I don't know what this block is going to look like. Uh, it's going to give me, I mean, it's kind of what we want, right? Sort of. It's, it's fine, right? That's fine. Uh, now this, however, um, we may end up changing. I might change the whole entrance into Carl's room here. Um, it's accusing me of being low energy again. All right. All right, so let's go back into these and place all of these things where they should go. Um, Okay, so now if I go into here and I build this up like I did in the hallway, then this could change here. That's still got glass there, right? Yes, okay, good. Um, yeah, let me move this door to here. There's a lot of stuff in this door, man. There's a lot of stuff in that door. Okay, that don't need, that don't need, that don't need, that don't need. Everything else is okay. All right, uh, door, corner, rotary. Should we give him like a really, really fancy door? Or is that gonna make it look weird from the outside? It's probably gonna make it look weird from the outside, so let's give him a plain old door. It'll be fine. And then we'll give him a very nice passage with a light. And then we'll make this one be the fancy wood. And that should be how that goes. And then we can take this out Oh, that was an LCD right there. Dang it. These individual glitches are kind of making things a little bit difficult. All right. So now that can go there. This can go here. And then I can go back to the wood and get ourselves a very nice uh, 45 degree angle right here to tie everything off. And that makes this look a lot nicer in my opinion. Because then it's like a straight view in and then immediately you get like this lovely lit area here. Then I gotta put the LCD back in there. All right. There we go. All right. Yeah, it just looks nicer, in my opinion. And then we need this block in there. That goes in there like that. We'll get rid of this block there. Oh, uh oh. I don't know if I can get rid of that block right there. No, can I? No. Mm. I don't know. Uh, all right. So then this is going to be the eight block looking thing here. Yeah. Now, did that mess anything up over here? It did not. Actually, um, let me grab this thing. Uh, let's see, wood and then that color.
There we go. Looks a little fancier, right? Give him a nice. Uh, that can probably stay. This we can change that. Change the LCD to be nice and I don't know. That can go right there. That can go right there. Should work, maybe. Maybe give that a nice little brown color. Uh, and then this, uh, what what is this exactly? A okay, so that's got to stay like that. All right, that's fine. Yes, now this hallway is much nicer. At least I think so. Okay, and then we have these two smaller rooms here, all set up. And then we have kind of like the red room over here, not that red room, but a red colored room because of the sci-fi blocks. And then we have this room, which is kind of more like a, uh, I don't know, what, what would we call this? It's like, a, this is a nicer room than probably both of those. And it's probably equivalent to this one over here, although this one does have a little bit more space. Hmm. And then uh, that is all. Okay. And then we have this. Right. And then I wanted to uh, change this to a catwalk. Because the light should still go through the catwalk, right? Um, and then I'm going to borrow this light info, if it'll let me, uh, there we go. And that it can go there and then that can go there. All right. Now, if I turn the lights off. <coughs> Yeah, I like it. All right. And then this uh, needs to be this and wood. Okay. And then we'll just kind of going all the way to the end. We should still get the light to shine through this, but it also creates like a little pathway. Yeah, I'm okay with this. All right. Um... Uh, let's see. And then we have this whole area in here, which I feel like, I don't know what purpose I want this to have, but I feel like it should have a uh, specific purpose. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe uh, complete the wall over to here. I don't know how that's going to look or work. I don't know. I'll just leave it for now. Um, so we've got most of everything in here done. Um, now, of course, we have to get the uh, the bar and club area done. Oh man, that's gonna be a whole thing. Hmm. That is just a busy looking building. But I mean, I think that's kind of what we want it to be, right? It's definitely unique looking. And even from the back, it looks pretty nice, which is good. 
I like that I can see the red room in there from out here. And then all of the other like little blocks that are behind the glass, you can't really see them too much. I mean, a little bit, but not too bad. And of course, you got the tree in there, which is doing its own thing, which is great. Um, let's see. If I wanted to close this whole thing off. Well, one, this is going to be the only open part, open point right now uh, to get in here. And then, uh, let's see, how do I want to, hmm, and I still have to set up the timer blocks for these things, and then uh, I would like, I want to have, like, you walk into this thing and, like, you have to go downstairs to get to, like, the main bar area, and it's kind of, like, built into the floor. I think that would be kind of cool. And then we have, you know, kind of like the areas around it built up a little bit. And then just kind of like sitting areas or I don't know. And then I'm going to have to have the VIP area over here. So it's going to have its own thing going on. Um, oh, man. There's going to be a lot. There's going to be a lot with this. So I suppose the first thing that we do is we parcel off each of the pieces and parts, right? So this is the VIP area. And then this is going to have to come out. And then we'll put that in there. And then we can build around this. Something like that anyways. Um, and then this has to go out. And then we're gonna need to have a dance floor, of course absolutely required um, let's see and then uh, in the VIP area I want this to be kind of like a quieter not so raucous um, so perhaps think of like the VIP area as like an upper scale club right where you need to I don't know, have a certain name or have a certain net worth to enter or some, something stupid like that. But it'll have like its own little bar thing set up in here, but it'll be more quaint, more personable, I guess. And so we have all of that space to work on that. Okay, and then this is going to be kind of like the bar area. Um, okay, so let me let me see how I want to do this. And then I have to figure out uh, the depth of our little Energy. sewer area under here, sort of like the uh, the slums, I guess. One way to look at it. So it'll be away from like all of the hustle and bustle of, you know, normal life. And it'll be kind of like the uh, darker underbelly, I guess. So let me see, how do I want to do this? Um, hmm. I want to have like, I don't know, like lights just flashing everywhere. At least over in the dance area, which is going to be probably this corner. And then, um, let's see, and then I want to have like a larger kind of sunken in bar area. And then we'll have, I don't know, like a 
a layer of sitting areas, so just like tables all around the end here. And then of course, getting over onto this area is the only way that you can get over here. So I'm thinking maybe we make this, uh, is that, hang on, I just need to make sure that's hooked up to the right thing. So maybe we get like a private hallway over here. So from the main entrance, you go off to the side and then that'll take you up to here. And then uh, we wanna make this like all glass because this is gonna be where Carl will kind of like, as he's walking or whatever, take a look at how the club is doing. And then I'll give him like his own little private area over here um, where he can kind of like look down upon everything. So I gotta figure out how to get that to work in here. And then we have to get like, like a big entrance area. I have no idea how to do that though. Like it's gotta be like grand, right? It's gotta be like, you look up, you look around, and it's just like awesome. Um, so I'm thinking we're gonna go with our red again. But instead of that, we're gonna go It doesn't have to be like super big, but it definitely has to be, I don't know, it has to make you think. It's like, what kind of a place is this, right? Um, okay, so then let's go with this and then I'll do a 45. So that will go to here. Or, you know what, even better. Um, let's go with this. And then we can put the 45 back in here. Yeah, I think that'll... Then we'll go into here, and then that. We'll go to there, and then we want this to go to here, and then maybe like a half block. I mean, it has to be a half block uh, in here to sort of complete the look, I guess. And then I feel like we're gonna need like black. Maybe instead of having the 45s here, we change this up a little bit and we have black to offset the red. So let's go with the pure black in here. Sir, this, okay. Oh wait, no, 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 better yet. Um, let's go into here. Because then I can play off of this with the two by one tips. And if these are too reflective, I may do, because they're looking really, 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 really reflective. Um, it might be a good idea to do the carbon fiber in here instead. Yeah, that's, yeah, it's not working. I need something that's not quite as shiny. It needs to be kind of like a matte it has to, you know, punctuate the shiny red. And then 
then we can do some windows in here also, Matt. Um, nope, we're gonna, yeah. Uh, probably just normal windows. So then that goes in here like that. So then when you get into this place, I still have to put the entrance in here. This is what you're gonna see. Like just huge, just kind of entrance area type thing. Um, I feel like it needs more, like a, I got it. Um, so let's go with the red going into here. Yeah, those visual glitches are definitely something else. All right, so that can go there and there. Okay, now we want the couch, but the couches have to be the matte black carbon fiber. Why does that still look red? Black carbon fiber, or is that just how reflective it is? Hmm. No, I need something that is Actually, for a couch, the dusty doesn't actually look too bad. Concrete. All right. Now this will be kind of like the waiting area. And then I can put some planters in between here just to make it look a little bit more, eh, you know, inviting. Uh, it's still too shiny though. Like, what do I have that's not shiny? No, no. Uh, weldless. Still too shiny. Sci fi. So now you can see out of here. Um, all right, so with that, now we need to do kind of like our main entrance. So that's gonna be a couple of rotating doors. Hmm. Is that gonna be in the way or do I do just like a single? Uh, Dr. Close Enough says, your space dock is the pinnacle of what many a Pokemon tamer aspire for, hunting shinies. All right, so now we need to get this to look, I don't know, dangerous. Uh, Dr. Kosanov says, LOL, anyway, how's it going, Mr. Uplifted? It is going well. Just uh, attempting to figure out how to make this look fantastic. And uh, it's it's all very shiny and reflective, and I don't know how I feel about that. And then uh, this, I suppose, can just go down to here. 
And then for here, um, like windows of some sort. I don't know if we go with like this or how would that, where would that even go? Or I go like this and I have it be like that on either side. And then I could do like a window, two by one, angled, sloped. Apparently I need girders, all right. Uh, how are you, Dr. Close Enough? How's the family? How's the pets? How's the husband? Dude, when you compare this to like everything else, this is like, I don't know, man. Uh, okay, so we're gonna go into here, grab some of these. We're gonna change this to the shiny red because reasons. Hmm. Actually, let's do an LCD. Dr. Gilson of says, feeling like I was lazy today since I only got one thing done. It was for my stream, but now I have 3D Shiba Inu pet for all of my AIs to speak from. Uh, so it works, but still only that one thing done. That sounds like a lot for getting, you know, just one thing done. All right, and then from here, we probably want to go back with... 45s. Uh, I got my taxes done today. That's fun. Of course, I do them myself, so... Uh, let's see. Dutch Kosom says, Pets are doing well. Went to a nearby field and let them run a ton. All needed baths after since it's been raining uh, the last couple of days, but they got to burn off a lot of energy. That's always good. As far as my taxes go, for the first time ever, I actually owe money. I don't know how that works. But, you know, it is what it is. Um, and then in between here, we're going to go with the red. Strictly for laughs and giggles, we're going to fill in all of that. So does this look uh, ominous enough for a club? 
kind of going for ominous, but like cool ominous. All right, so then from here, um, yeah, this is just going to be a lot. Uh, Raskosanov says, husband is doing okay. He's still searching for jobs. Sadly, he's visiting a friend while the friend is working. Aha. Uh -huh. That's unfortunate. Uh, what about the job that uh, he went in for an interview for, I believe it was? Did that not go so well? Because he was excited about that one, wasn't he? Is kind of funny, Doctor Close enough. <laughs> uh, that sucks. Uh, Doctor Close enough says husband was excited for the job he interviewed for, but they didn't select him. That sucks, man. So now for the hard part. Um, this whole thing, I'm going to try to get it to go diagonally that way and diagonally up that way as well. And then uh, let's see, we're going to change this LCD. Dr. Kolosanov says, unemployment ends in another three weeks, too, with no extensions allowed, so now it's an application frenzy. Horrible pay is better than no pay. Yeah. Uh, for taxes, congrats on the adulting. Uh, did the same on Thursday and also same had to pay for the first time ever. Yeah, my dad did, too, which is unusual because... Uh, Dr. Kosanov says, answering early question, yes, the club entrance looks evil, makes me think hiding my travel toothbrush that I take with me in case I need a ship. <laughs> That's hilarious. And then I think I probably want to put in some lights in the ceiling because I, I do have a couple of uh, open spots here that I covered up with that. So that's going to have to be inset light. 
and then black, shiny. And then uh, this one also gets to come out. Ooh. That can go there. All right, now this, um, as soon as it wants to load up for me, sir. Thank you. Uh, all right, so this range, we're gonna make this like 15, because it has to be huge. Um, intensity, uh, probably a one, because we want it to be like really far off. And then that, uh, color, we'll go kind of like a dingy, a dingy off-white. Kind of like a yellowish, I guess. Um, and this is going to be light Carl's place entrance. And then we'll copy all of that. Paste it into there. Now we have a very nicely lit area in here. I like it. It's definitely um, got a vibe to it. Although I don't think that is actually sealing right there, so I might actually have to fix that, unfortunately. Um, I mean, because it looks like it does, sort of, and maybe it does, actually, with that edge being there. But then again, if you look through here, you got that wide open gap right there. So I don't think that actually works. Um, hmm. Okay, so we'll just take that off. And then, uh, let's see, we will replace it with the red. At least this way, I know that absolutely that will seal. Although it's, it's not exactly what I'm looking for. I want it to be like inset, kind of like that. But I don't think I can actually get that to work. Now what I might be able to do is grab these little guys and put each of these Going all the way up. Yeah, it's a bit more like it, I think. Um, can I push this out? Answer, yes. Yes, I can. So now we need to go back to the black, shiny. Uh, that can go to there, to there, to there. All right, and then this gets a full block. Followed by a small block like this. Here we go, that's a little better, I think. Yes, that is much better. Okay, good. All right, now we need to go back to the red. Um, all right, so now for this part, um, no, this has to go out to here, I think. No, it's going to have to go out to here. And then this can go out to here. And then that can go out to there. And then that can go out to there. And then of course that one can go out to there. And then we go back to the black. And then this is where we get 
offset by one. Or, or, or. No, I can't do that. Dang it. I was thinking I put windows on here or something. I don't think that's gonna work though. Okay, so that goes all the way over to And that can go to there. And then this can go to here. And that can go to there. Hmm. Now, is that going to be. No, I'm not going to be able to put that in there, I don't think. No, nope. that's going to be in the way. Um, I was thinking, like, if I could find a way to put, like, some windows in there or something, offset the windows. I think once we get to here, uh, we could start putting in some windows. Because then that will align very well with that. Of course, that's going to have to go. No. That's not going to work. OK, so then I have to put in. <sighs> All right. Um... This can just get blocked in, I think. And I could just do, I don't know, like this, maybe. Uh, Dr. Gosno says, congrats, by the way. I saw that Cows Are Evil is watching your Stationeers video, who is a major influence for you. Yes, yes, he is. It's very cool. Um, I mean, watching his videos is basically what taught me about a lot of the more complex processes of stationaries. So without Mick, um, I would probably not be doing as well as I am with stationaries. Now, that being said, um, doesn't mean that I'm necessarily doing well. So uh, little spoiler alert, um, stuff blew up. Uh, and uh, it, it was, yeah. Uh, it very nearly ended that run. It was bad. But uh, you'll have to find out more about it uh, when it goes live. All right, so that can go over to here and then that. Can go into here. And then from here, I think we go into 45s. Uh, let's see. Dr. Kosinov says it is a difficult level either way. GG. Thank you. All right. Now, let's see if I can get this in here properly.
Oh, and then uh, if I'm going to do Carl's little hallway through here, this is going to have to go. Then this should be good there. Okay. So how do we feel about that for like the side of the entrance here? I mean, of course, I'm going to have this kind of built up, I guess. Uh, probably just put in like just normal gray background here. Or I could put in windows. I could do that. But then it kind of depends on what I do here. Um, hmm. Um, I could do like panels in here, maybe. Just need like a 45 degree angle in here and then go with the red. And then that can go into that, that can go into that. And that will just be kind of ended there. I don't know. You think Carl will like it? I think he'd like it. All right, and then um, we're gonna have to put in some blocks here. Okay, so like this one can come out. And then we just go with like a normal gray boring. Unable to place slope. Oh, right, because that is not the right block. run this over here somehow. Dr. Kostanov says, I think he'll like it. Good. Hmm. I don't know if I like that being there on the side, but I don't think I have much of a choice. Hmm. So that is where that goes, and then this goes here, there, there, and there. What does this look like? That would be like white lines. Do I want white? No, I think I want to keep the red. Okay, so we'll definitely keep that. Um, all right, and then this needs to be next to each one of these with one of these in front. So there's that, and then this needs to go back to this.
Okay, so there's that. Good. Alright, and then from here, it's 45s going back. Okay. Alright, now. About this, I think this maybe gets to change. Hmm. I don't know yet. Let me just uh, put this over here. This will be kind of what we're backing up against here. Um, Okay, and then this needs to go. Oh, wait, 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 no, these aren't 45s. These are panels. I'm smart. <sighs> okay. All right, let's try this again. Just with panels this time. All right, panel 45, good. There we go. All right. Now, so once I had that, I went with the two by one going back. Okay. that is there. I went to a 45. Right? Yeah. But first, I got to put in these blocks. And then the 45 goes there. Or something like that. And then from here, this is all legit 45s going this way. which I already have. Go back to the red. And... That'll just kind of go there. That'll be good. And then... Um, yeah, and then behind these, we have each of the normal gray boring blocks. Four, five. This has one, two, three, four. Uh oh. We're off by one. <laughs> uh, is this whole thing off by one? Better not be. Did I do something wrong? Doesn't look like it. Okay, so then from the center block, we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. And then 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Huh. Well, that's awkward. Hmm. 
Hmm. It's fine. We'll just cheat it a little bit. There we go. <laughs> All right. So now we have this scary looking thing. And then this is going to have to be updated ever so slightly. And this will just be kind of like a false wall right here. It won't actually be anything. And then uh, we can get rid of these blocks. And then it'll look just like the other side. There you go. This is probably like the most extreme design I've ever done for a building in Space Engineers. I think it suits though. I think like if you take in like the building as a whole, right? Like it just, I don't know, looks kind of a little menacing, a little foreboding, but at the same time, like, yeah. <laughs> um, all right. Now, once we get up to this part over here, uh, this is where I want to go maybe a little, little interesting here. Um, I'm going to put in a bunch of doors, just like a bunch of doors. And the purpose of these doors is to connect to a balcony that's going to be out here. It's only going to be two blocks wide. And then, um, let's see, can I get this to extend out just a little bit farther? So let's get this just kind of, okay, sir, really, on top of that block, please, if you don't mind. And then uh, we'll do like one of these little things. At least it's even on both sides. All right, next, um, catwalk. Plain old boring catwalk here. All right, and then for this, we don't have a diagonal catwalk, do we? No, we do not. Would be cool, but if we don't have it, we don't have it. All right, so then this goes over to here.
Now keep in mind this little balcony here is VIP only access. Okay, and then we'll go into the windows here, and I want these ones, and then I want them to be red. Now I can't really tell the difference here. These are gonna go floor to ceiling. throw in some corner lights and then these need to go down so let's put these here Kosana says, only VIP access slowly puts away travel toothbrush turned shiv. I guess I just need to stop by Walmart on my way home. Uh, no, so the club itself is accessible by anyone, right? But up here, this is the VIP area that is not accessible by anyone or everyone. So what I need to do now is to... Let's see, uh, radius is going to be, I don't know, like 15 or something. Just something crazy. Uh, and then if I put this offset, where does that go? That goes outwards, not downwards. Okay. And I suppose it just kind of depends on how I put that on there then. Uh, intensity. Probably, we want it to be a little dark, but just enough to show a little bit of the color here. Um, let's see, light, Carl's place, front balcony, there we go. Then um, in the middle here, we'll do the black straight up blocks in here. And that gives it kind of an interesting an interesting look here. And then if I really, really wanted to uh, light this up, what I could do now is take some of these, turn them red, This could be a solid line, or I could have a break in the middle. I think I want the break in the middle. Let's 
see that looks a little a little more sinister I feel like I'm making Carl out to be like an evil genius or something like an evil mastermind I wonder if he'll mind <laughs> uh, fun times um, okay so up here is VIP, and then we'll have an upper level in here for regular guests. And then, so that's gonna need its own level, I guess. So to build this out some more. Okay, so now I gotta figure out Uh, Dr. Kosano says, Carl is very patient, so he could have the disposition for the evil times. Interesting. Um, all right, so now from here, how do we want this to look? I feel like... Something like this here, and then we'll take this over here to go in there like that. And then we'll have windows above this. And then these will be just like full floor to ceiling windows. Um, let's see. I'm trying to think. Um, I'm gonna change these pillars out. Make them just slightly different. Okay, so instead of that, they're still gonna be the plain dull gray, but Just having a little, little extra, I don't know, something to them. Make them look more, I don't know, structural, I guess. Now, it's still the same over here as far as like all of this stuff goes. And we still have connection points that we can connect to. So, we're gonna go Windows. One by one, uh, flats, that'll work. Uh, and then these are gonna have to be the red because they're in that stripey pattern bit. Okay, so now we're gonna need this to be inverted. Um, okay, so then that can go there. Yeah, and then breaking them into individual windows, I think, is the right call. So that's good. So that very nearly completes the front fascia of the building. So that's cool. Um, now, as far as this goes, um, okay, so just because you make it into this area doesn't mean you make it into the club. So now, we get to uh, put in the rest of this. So um, let's see, we're gonna do another door, straight up rotary airlock door. This will be the black, and then that can go there. And then this will go straight up to the ceiling. And then we'll do, let's see, go into here like this and then uh, for just a little bit of extra eh, color I guess and then we'll go with the windows here
There we go. I think that works. And that uh, seals off that area, so that's all well and good. And then I could have like, I don't know, like a table over here for like club goers to like, they can just like stand here and like look at all the people waiting to get inside and just like laugh at them. Um, okay. Now it is very, very dark and dingy in there, so definitely got to add some lights and spruce up the place. Um, I just want the entrance to be kind of like sinister looking. I want the inside to be, you know, very bright. Well, maybe not super bright, but you know, appealing, I guess. I'm okay with this. And now I have hiccups for some reason. Okay, so this has got to be Carl's private way up. So he needs his own. We're just going to make this look fantastic if we can. It's got to be very, very chic, private, yet still obvious to anyone who is looking. Um, so we're going to throw in a door here. And then uh, we'll go with the red, I suppose. And then, um, okay, so now for this part. Uh, okay, so now we need stairs to go up. We want these stairs to be visible to anyone and everyone who might be looking. And then the easiest way to do that, well, one is to encase it in glass. So that way, it's just like a private thing going all the way up to the top here. Um, and then, uh, let's see, how do we want? I wonder if this would work. Now this has got to be red, this part. So if I put that there, oops, didn't mean for that one to go there. But with the panels here, right, it doesn't block movement at all. It doesn't take up much space, but it should allow me to place these stairs on here. And then once we get up to the top, then we are in the dull gray. Okay, now to encase this, uh, we're gonna go with windows. Uh, two by one, nope, one by one. Now this isn't gonna like seal or anything like that, but the idea here Um, can I not? Oh, no, I need girders. Okay. It's gonna be like, can I not do this? Um, 301, maybe not that much, but definitely some. And then this is probably gonna have to be red. So the stairs are black, but the glass itself is red. Is that even the right red? It is not. There we go, nice dark red. Uh, 
Now again, the idea here is for Carl to be seen when he's walking up here. Doesn't have to interact. In fact, we don't want him to interact at all. But we need him to be seen. So if people know, oh, that's Carl. He's the boss here. Okay. So we need to do the same thing over here. All right, window. There we go. Now he has his own covered staircase. Going all the way up to the top. Very obvious for anyone who may be looking. And then, um, let's see, we'll throw in a railing because, you know, can't have the uh, common people going in here, right? Um, no railing, double railing. And then we'll get like a bellhop or something. Someone to protect this area. Um, okay, so. And then uh, we'll do an inset couch here. Okay, that is exactly how I was hoping that would be. All right. And this we're gonna make into black and shiny. So that way, over here, it's kind of like a sitting area. Uh, Dr. Kostanov says, Carl says that he is indeed evil, supports the evil club, and would come over, uh, but is setting up his own space engineer stream. Okay. Yeah, uh, he was saying yesterday that he uh, had that going on. So, very cool. Super happy for him. Uh, let's see. Panel. It's just got to go down on top because reasons. Or do I want that big red block to be there? No, it's better like that. Okay. All right. So here is Carl's very, very private um, stairway up to his private residence. And he'll also have a private overlook up here where he can look at the entirety of the club except for you know the vip area of course but then people can like be down here and like point up here and look oh look there's someone up there it's like oh i wonder if that's carl is that carl oh my god look it's carl yeah I'm enjoying this way too much. <laughs> uh, fun times. Um, all right, so get rid of those. Because we want the entrance to kind of be like its own thing. Um, and then we can shade or shape, I should say, this. Actually, you know what, no. We're gonna change this up a little tiny bit. Um, yeah, that's all the way out, okay, good. And then I think I'm gonna take out this block here. And then this will be the actual wall over here. And that's just kind of like an extra block that's out there. Um, okay, so let's see. Put this out. OK, 
Okay. All right, and now this gets to go out over here like this, and then um, let's see, let's set this up. There we go, and then we'll go one more. And then the way you get up over here is going to be from here. And then I have to put in some railing over here, and then it's just going to be. It will do like a little private bar up here. This will be kind of like a more quiet area section thing. Um, so let's do the countertops. Now, do we want these to be red or uh, counter? What are what is that part of? It's in Sparks of the Future, right? Yeah. Is this not included in a group of something somewhere? Um, is it in desk? No, it's not in desk, is it? No, it's not in desk. Couch? No, it's not in couch either. Huh. Well, hmm. Guess we'll just do it this way. All right, so we'll get. Oh no, that's gotta. It's gotta go out one more. There we go. All right, and then counter. And then uh, let's see. We'll put one over here and we'll put uh, the other one over here. And then we'll do uh, let's throw some desks in here. Alright, so that's gotta go to here to complete the bar. And then uh, that's gonna be a wall back there. Or something I don't know and this can go over to here this can go over to there that can go into that okay and um, I need energy so oh, over here and one of these days I got to finish up this clinic too Okay, so now uh, let's do some inset blocks here. So if I put the kitchen in here, what does that look like? And this is gonna have to be gray, I'm thinking. Um, okay, so that'll go in there like that. And then this needs to be some sort of storage of some sort. And then I'm pretty sure that does not work there. Actually, it might. I mean, not a gun rack, obviously, but, uh, you know, um, this. Yeah, it should work. And then, uh, See, we can put some, actually, you know what I could do? We can give this two areas uh, of entrance.
little wraparound bar over here. Um, let's see. Then uh, we'll give this a desk as well. This is going to be for the lonely guy who wants to drink by himself. Wants to be close, but not too close to everyone else. And then, um, let's see. Now we're going to need stairs getting up into here. And then, uh, let's see. Uh, yeah, we'll do it like this. All right, and then we'll do some LCDs over here. Little entertainment for the people. Um, we've got a bartender area back here. They can do their thing. Um, let's see, and then we'll probably can't do anything in that block space there, so. Probably bring that in like that. Do the same thing over here. And then in here, we'll just play this out, following the same kind of pattern here. Okay, so then this can go into here like that, I suppose. Wait, no, not like that. This one. Uh, okay, so that's gonna be this one, question mark. Yeah, that works. Okay. And this one is just special, apparently. Um, oh, because I did this wrong. OK, that's why. Yeah, that was supposed to be like that. OK, good to go. OK, and then that goes there. That goes up there, and then this is just going to be the next floor. I think that'll work. Small little bar area over here. Um, we'll put in some seats, a bunch of little tables, little four person tables all around here. Um, Can't put it in there though, unfortunately. And I'm out of interior plate. Okay. Oh wow, it is nine o'clock. Dude. Um Okay, let me just finish setting up this upper sitting area, and uh, we will close out after that, I think. Okay, now, can I make this look a little bit nicer? Just a little bit more spread out. Um... And uh, let's see, now it's just some railings along the edge here. Okay, so that one can go there. Okay, now these go over to here. So little places to sit. Um, I could make this a bigger table right here. 
So let me just take out those two. Uh, wait, sorry. This desk. There, that suits the area a little better. All right, and then I can't place in here. I can place in these three places, but not here. So let's make this one a bigger table than two. Okay, and then that needs to go to there and to there. All right. Okay, so that uses up the area a little bit more better, I guess. Now I just need to do like some sort of convoluted stairway going down out of here somehow. I don't know. Figure something out. Now from down here, I wonder if it would look better If I made this kind of beveled on the edge here, or if I leave it kind of angular. I think I leave it angular, actually. Yeah. I think we do it that way. All right, so um, with that, uh, we have done a lot. Um, I mean, we have like our entrance area, we have our entire front area done uh, and looking uh, quite badass if I do say so myself. Um, we've got, I still have to figure out the windows over here, but you know, that just be placing those little one buys over there. So that's all that's gonna be. Um, this, is this red? This is not red, it needs to be red. Is that red? Oh, it was not red. There we go. It's looking a little little spiffier. All right, so now, once we get here, this is what we are greeted with. Um, Carl's place, which is absolutely massive. And then he's got like this whole front entrance area he thing here. It just makes it look like an evil person's lair. And of course, this is the entry hall where people will wait uh, until the reservation is called. Um, but otherwise, you just uh, kind of go in here. Um, this will take you directly into the bar. I still want to set this down a little bit. So you have to kind of like walk down into it. And then over here, we'll have kind of like an upper, quieter eating area. We'll have Carl's little perch over there where he can observe all of the goings on um, inside of here. And. Uh, he has his own little uh, secret, not so secret, everyone look at me stairwell. And then, uh, yeah, so our first little bar is up here, so that's working out well. Um, I'm going to have to put in some lights, so I'll have to figure out where I want to put those. Um, and probably a bunch in here, actually, to light it up correctly. Uh, but yes, yeah, so we got a couple of kitchens in here. We got a bunch of uh, bar counters here. Plenty of seating going all around. Uh, this will be window, I guess, all through here. So we'll figure that out. Um, but yeah, so that that is what we've got so far. But uh, with that, I'm going to call uh, this an end to the stream tonight. Uh, hopefully you guys have enjoyed. And if you did, hopefully you'll join me for the next one. <sighs> Man, I'm tired. <laughs> There's a lot of designing. Um, but yeah, so uh, come join me tomorrow night, 7 p.m. Central Standard Time from Freedomland. And uh, that's all I got, man. 